The Nintendo Wii revolutionized the gaming industry and brought motion controls to the masses. And controlling gaming like this once again opened the door up to casual gamers who didn't need to be intimidated by modern control schemes with dual thumbsticks, multiple triggers, and double digit buttons. Not only did the Wii sell well with over 100 million, which by modern console standards doesn't even seem that high, it also sold a staggering 921 million games to go with it. The key to those games revolved around a few pillars, motion, fitness, mini games, and local multiplayer. It didn't need to have all those features, but most of the hits for the system were built around them. Now that the Nintendo Switch features everything that the Wii did, it might be time for some casual gamers to get back into the gaming world. Obviously, it would be very easy if we just listed the ports from Wii or Wii U, but instead, here are five original games on the Nintendo Switch that are most like having a modern day Wii. The best selling game on the Wii was Wii Sports with almost 83 million, mostly due to it being packed in with the console for a very long time. And for the first five years of the Switch, there was nothing that replicated that feeling, and that changed in 2022 when Nintendo Switch Sports was released. In our review, we said the Switch Sports was a very solid entry in the series that has a lot of potential but limited variety, and with the free golf update coming in fall 2022, and hopefully more in the future, this will become the best entry in the series. Wii Fit was the sixth best selling game on the Wii with over 22 million, and that is very impressive for a fitness centric game that was a premium price due to the the inclusion of the balance board peripheral. The weakness of Wii Fit was that it forgot about the fun. Ring Fit Adventure fixed that problem by making a game out of exercising. You need to be Drago the bodybuilding dragon by completing strength and yoga based exercises that were completing using the resistance ring and the leg strap that both housed a Joy-Con making a fun and accurate workout. The 10th best selling game on the Wii was Wii Party with almost 10 million copies sold. Wii Party was a collection of mini games similar to the Mario Party series that was built around motion controls and local mayhem except you didn't control famous Nintendo characters. Mario Party Superstars is a best of collection for the series which means that many fan favorites are here. If you want mini games and mayhem then Mario Party Superstars is sure to make everyone happy. The novelty of the Wii was motion based gaming which is no secret. What if you wanted the same motion based sports from Wii Sports but wanted something a little deeper? Mario Tennis Aces and Mario Golf Super Rush have everything you need. These aren't the best entries in the series, but they do have some depth as well as motion controls, which if you're looking for something similar to what you played on the Wii, these two games should scratch that itch. Another great seller on the Wii was Wii Play that sold over 28 million. However, that was likely due to it being included with another Wii mote, which most people needed, and it was only a few extra bucks for the game. Wii Play featured a collection of minigames like Shooting Gallery Tanks and a bunch of other motion based minigames. Clubhouse 51 features a version of both Tanks and Shooting Gallery, but also features things like fishing. Clubhouse 51 also features many tabletop and card games. There were plenty other games that were popular on the Wii like Smash, Mario, and Mario Kart that have also made their way to the Switch with gigantic success, but these six games seem focused around the core pillars of what made the Wii the casual behemoth that it became. So if you're looking for that same experience, start here.